At Keith Family YMCA in University City, the teams turned out with a sense of finality. Well, I'm a proud uh, Mirror League player, and today's our last game of the season. All right, if we can have our players and coaches please line up along the first and third base lines. The Braves and the Rockies stand for the national anthem, but they also stand for all the good that comes from friendly competition. And that deserves a high five. What's special is you get to see the kids out there doing something that other kids, you know, kind of take for granted. There we go, great hit. On the weekend before Halloween, some played in costume. Wasting no time, Gabe James, AKA Spider-Man. Uh, look it up on the web. The YMCA Miracle League gives people with mental and physical disabilities a chance to have a ball on the diamond in a place where everyone's rooting for you, whether you hit or miss. Great swing by Amelia. Oh, there we go. Folks, he's coming home. What a rush. First score, put your hands together for Andrew. Nicholas Batley, who has autism, is a league veteran. I'm, re I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm going to do my part. My team's going to do the rest. Junior on deck. You know, it's good exercise for me. Um, it's It's been a lot of fun because I just really love this league, and it's just a lot of fun that we get to be here. His mom, Wendy, wasn't about to miss the season finale. And Nicholas plays on the competitive league, which is new this year. They actually keep score, um, count outs. Wow, what a great hit. And if you were keeping score, the game was a thriller. Junior score. There we go. With all eyes on the scoreboard, it was the bottom of the second and final inning. Nicholas with a chance to deliver, and boy, did he. There we go. Great hit by Nicholas on the center field. Carter Moeller. Nicholas smacks the ball into center field to put the Braves in front. His first ever triple. But Nicholas's mother says the 10-5 final score doesn't begin to describe her son's Miracle League experience. Socially, he's become a lot more aware of other people. Um, he's become a better competitor and a great sportsman. After shaking hands with their opponents, the ball players look forward to a year-end tradition. Nicholas, our Miracle League chaplain and our captain. Basically, we get to have trophies at the end of the at the end of the game. And the one who hit in our game-winning RBI today. After that, it kind of gets really kind of sad because, you know, it's the last game of the season. The Miracle League gives them so much to believe in. I hope all of y'all are coming back next year. And that's why walking away from the season one, two, is so bittersweet. Three. In Charlotte, John Lee, Queen City News.